Uh, I just got back uh, from Yuma, Arizona uh, to Pittsburgh, uh, 12, uh, 12 hours and three flights later. Uh, I'm just reflecting on what I saw there. And uh, you know, two things come to mind. First, what an epic failure of leadership. Uh, the policies that uh, President Biden and, and Bob Casey and, and others have put in place have really been, been terrible for America. Uh, enormous uh, challenges associated with 10 million illegal migrants enter, entering our country, uh, enormous economic burden, um, an enormous national security challenge. Uh, 160 folks just last year uh, that came across the border were identified on the terrorist watch list. Those are just the ones that were apprehended. And of course, the fentanyl crisis, which uh, which I saw firsthand talking to the uh, uh, the folks there on the border about how that fentanyl comes across. Arizona is where, where about 50% of the fentanyl uh, comes across the border. So this has been t- just terrible for America and terrible for Pennsylvania. Uh, but more than that, it's been a tragedy on a very human level. I mean, the amount of human exploitation, uh, particularly of women and children coming across the border is just horrific. And the cartels are not only in the drug business, they're very much in the human trafficking business. And we heard a lot about that. And uh, people essentially sell themselves into servitude uh, to be able to get across the border. It's, it's just horrific. And, uh, and, and the burden on, on, on those that are trying to help uh, in this tragic situation, the Border Patrol really under-resourced, uh, facing a, just a, a very almost unworkable situation. Uh, the healthcare workers that we met uh, on the border trying to deal with a, an, an overwhelmed system uh, as these illegal migrants come in and, and really put an enormous burden on the community from a healthcare perspective. And that, that happens in many places around the country. So this is, this is a tragedy on multiple levels. And it just comes down to a basic failure of leadership. Uh, Joe Biden has failed us. Uh, Bob Casey and those that have supported these terrible policies have failed us. And they, they can't possibly know how bad it really is or they wouldn't be supporting these policies.